So leading to more encounters with wildlife. And this morning, a scare for some parents and kids on their way to school. They spotted a mountain lion in Cameron Park, and there were several sightings on the streets around Blue Oak Elementary School in Cameron Park. That prompted the school to go on a soft lockdown. And KCRA 3 Sharkina Shams joining us for live from Cameron Park with what happened next. Colson, there were actually two schools here in Cameron Park that went into lockdown for a time this morning. One of them was Blue Oak Elementary School behind me, the other just around the corner from here, Camarado Middle School. Now, parents reported spotting that mountain lion this morning as they were walking and driving their children to school. There is a conglomeration of homes in this part of Cameron Park, several different subdivisions where parents walking and driving their children to school reported seeing a mountain lion. I heard you've got to confront it, make yourself look big, make loud noises, scare it off, and pray it doesn't come after you. The mountain lion, much like this one that had to be tranquilized last year in Turlock, was nowhere to be found when fish and wildlife crews searched at about 9 a.m. Based upon the reports from the citizens who had seen it, it was running. And it looked like it was running in a direction that was, for the most part, away from the populated area. But Blue Oak Elementary School principal Paul Stewart wanted to be sure and put the school on a soft lockdown. We said, you know, kids can go out to recess, they can still continue instruction, but we're keeping everyone off the field just to be safe. That lockdown was lifted at 9 40 this morning. We live in the area where they live, and um, it happens. Um, you just got to. Uh, prepare yourself for something like this and know what to do when you do see one. And, and a fish and wildlife spokesman tells us if you do spot a mountain lion, you should not try to turn around and run. You should try to look tall and make loud noises to scare the animal away. Tonight at 6, much more about why mountain lions are attracted to this particular area and why more often this time of year. And the one specific advice for kids should they run into a mountain lion when they're by themselves. Live here in Cameron Park, I'm Shara Shams, KCRA 3 News. All right, look forward to that. See you at 6, Shara.